the Silva today toured the Busia and Uganda one-stop borders post and pledged his government's commitment towards enhancing cross-border trade between Kenya and Uganda. Addressing the one-stop border post management led by both Kenya and Uganda revenue authorities, the Silva disclosed that his government who has injected a whopping 187 million shillings Canadian dollars to improve infrastructure in both Kenya and Uganda and called on the two countries to maintain cordial bilateral border friendship. So you just, you just, it's, you find it. I am delighted to be visiting and learning about the success of the Busia one-stop concept and the cooperation between Kenyan officials like the Deputy County Commissioner and his team, as well as the Ugandan officials who are working to make things smoother, faster, better, cheaper, and simpler for not just the big lorries that you see passing behind us, but also for the tens of thousands of individuals that are crossing the border and the hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of small scale traders, particularly the women who are crossing back and forth every single day for their businesses, for their education, for their families, for their careers. I am very, very impressed in terms of project work. Overall, Canada um, contributes about 160, 170 million dollars to Uganda and Kenya combined every single year. It's a one-stop order post concept, which is very unique. So many countries are not using, but Kenya and Uganda has decided to adopt this very important concept of cross-border business. These have had long stretches of trucks crossing the border, but that problem which was existing has been solved 